Concentration camps are probably the most well-known facet of World War II history, with schools all over the world detailing the atrocities of the Nazi party. In saying this, hearing about such a soulless and purely evil act is one thing, however, experiencing it firsthand is quite another. When the 45th Infantry Division were given orders to liberate the concentration camp known as Dachau, the shock was more brutal and disgusting than they could have ever imagined. And as per the title of today's video, the reaction of the American infantry onto the SS guards of the camp was equally as brutal. On April 29th of 1945, the first unit to arrive at Dachau concentration camp was the 45th Infantry Division of the United States Army. Although the men were only given orders to liberate the camp, they were so horrified by the stench and sight of the masses of decomposing Jewish bodies that they decided to escalate the situation, and in the most drastic way they knew how. American GIs proceeded to gather as many Waffen SS soldiers they could find and summarily shoot them on sight, no questions asked. Many of the Americans vented their unexplainable anger on behalf of the souls murdered at Dachau to some of the camp's senior officials. According to Captain David Walsey, some guards were tortured for extended periods of time, with the GIs making them stand for hours in Heil Hitler salutes and pouring ice water over their naked backs before they were eventually shot dead. He professed in a letter to his wife that he did not have a single disturbed emotion because he saw the Nazis as SS beasts that deserved to be slaughtered. The revenge, however, was not only enjoyed by the American GIs, but also the liberated Jewish prisoners, and understandably so. One of the prisoners, named Walenty Lenachik, recounted that immediately after the liberation of the camp, the prisoners gained a newfound sense of courage and began catching SS soldiers. He stated that they all knocked them down and nobody could see whether they were stomped or what, but they were killed. This quote implying that many of the Jewish prisoners beat the guards and their dogs to death. As Walenty puts it, we were all these years animals to them and it was our birthday. All in all, it's estimated that 30,000 prisoners were liberated that day and over a thousand SS soldiers were summarily executed by American troops. It should be noted, however, that there were some SS units and a unit of Hungarian soldiers that were executed by the Americans despite having nothing to do with the camp. And this has been the cause of controversy between many historians and authors about the morality of these infantrymen to take the law and justice into their own hands. However, I'll let you be the judge of that, and as per usual, I'd love to hear responses and stories in the comments section below. And just before you go guys, please do consider donating to the Patreon as every single dollar helps, especially with a channel like this that YouTube loves to demonetize because of the title and the, just the content of the video. So as I said, any dollar helps guys, make sure you check it out and help us increase the quality and quantity of videos that are posted on this channel. And anyways guys, as always, thanks for watching and I hope you learned something new.